me the rabbit that hated carrots. I got this. Long ago, an evil rabbit by the name of Connor Cottonballs hated the fact his brother on Planet Bunny loves carrots, so he devised a plan to destroy all carrots with a giant ball totally not the Death Star. Okay, what did I write? Oh. oh, how do I even do that? Hey, dude. <laughs> you okay? Hey, man, bro, brother, from another same mother. So, Matt, you wanna play a board game later, or...? You having one of those, I'm a f***ing loser fits? No! 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 Look, I know you want you have big, in, like, aspirations of becoming a big filmmaker in Hollywood, but... You're 16, for God's sake! We live in a townhouse, we have limited space! Uh, what makes you think that? Dude, at night... I hear you through the wall screaming about your problems. It's not healthy. <laughs> why, God, why? Why can't I have been born in the Hollywood lifestyle? Boy, I would have chicks and drugs and die young. And everyone would be like, why he die young? He had so much potential and really, I did I mean, he didn't. Oh. <laughs> uh. What are you doing? It, it, it's a flashback, you can't see. Right. Well, I'm gonna go sulk downstairs and bye. Man, I love Jake, but like, he's got so many f What the f am I talking to? Well, little brother, you sure you don't need my help? Look, I... ...said that? It was me, Drake! <sighs> what the f***? What the crap? What? And Jake, I told you to fix your problems with your cursing. Uh, I, uh, you can't be in my videos. I, I get demonetized. Duh! Is this a joke? It's me, Drake, your twin brother, since we were born. Well, actually, I was born three minutes ahead of you, so I guess that makes me the older brother. I also killed mom and dad, that's why they're not in the house. <gasps> what? Jeez, man, they're out getting groceries. I was, did you usually really like my jokes? Or at least, you know, my uh, 60 million subscribers on YouTube were like them, huh? Uh... What's your YouTube channel name? Uh, it's VVGG, man. Did you punch yourself in the face again and forget who I was? No. Uh, no. What about Pat? You mean Matt? Me? Him? Big man, come on, you, you know this, right? Damn, dude from the Jetpack Joyride, you looking kind of fun today, I don't know about you. You're rather f***ing dragon, yeah. <laughs> man, you won't believe what the f*** happened! Dang it, I died! <sighs> yeah, Drake is just on the couch watching TV. Okay, obviously, this is all a dream, I punched myself in the face, none of this is real. Again? You did this again? Really? I, okay, I punched myself in the face one time before, but still- What's up, bros? Were you spying on me? 
No. Yes. I mean, no. Hmm? Look. Shank forgot why he, he just forgot who the heck you are. Quick montage on explaining who you are again, man. Oh, sure! And you, we can do so by you being finally in one of my own videos! Right? Uh, I don't think we're montaging. Uh, I think Matt said it as a joke. I mean, uh, you use film words all the time, so we like to humor you about, you know? I mean, you wanna go to film school, and I, it, but that, but being a filmmaker is like way too hard. Like, you have to know what's it and blah blah. I just, you know, like to wing it and post. You know? Can you spit more exposition about why I'm not in more of your, uh, videos, uh, since I want to be like a filmmaker and all that? Oh, sure, man. I'll, I'll explain all the, all the exposition you need. Uh, and we better do this quick, though. Our parents are gonna get back from the grocery store in like four hours. That does sound like our parents, but I mean, do I have to wear all this crap? I mean, is it really that necessary? You want to go to film school and be the best in like making movies and whatnot, but for me, that's just always like uh, what's the word? The uh, the weight of actually trying to be good. So like you know, I like I just think like if we come up with enough stupid, shit, we might have something interesting for all to see on YouTube. My 60 million subscribers love me for it. Can I count on you? Uh, fine. I don't even have a guitar pick, but fine, whatever. Let's just do this. Great job, man. Okay, we did the montage. Uh, uh, I, I think I'm getting memories about you. <laughs> oh God, wow. So, uh, let's, uh, I mean, I don't know how cool this was, but I mean, I am curious. Uh, what are you gonna do with all of this in post? Oh, nothing. I just record you acting like the loser you always been. That's gonna go viral. What? Also, I did kill mom, dad, Kyle. Softa, and also Matthew while you weren't looking. Right, okay Jake, now just go behind your back and uh, don't look around. Keep your eyes closed. Uh, five minutes and uh, just sing some random weird stuff, okay? Good. I'll blindly trust you. No, 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 my eyes are closed, no, 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 no. Time to kill Matthew. Holy shit, why? I don't know, man. Maybe I've got bored of success. Maybe I'm jealous of you, the fact that your life is so simplistic. Maybe it's your fault. No, I'm just bored. Now, I'm gonna kill you. Oh crap. <laughs> it was a dream after all. Wow. Oh. Well, so that he doesn't exist for real. I'm gonna be cheery for the rest of the day with, uh, with no chance of uh, irony coming my way. What? Oh, good, you're awake. What the f What? You're not real. What about this uh, family picture? What, what the, that's Samson. Why would that even trick me in the slightest? Oh yeah, um, her old dog, uh, Samson. Mm -hmm. Hey, to be fair, this was on the spot. What the hell are you screaming at? Well, uh, Matt, yeah, I was, it, it. Matt, I had a weird dream, and a weird hallucination. I don't think that's how it works. I don't know if a hallucination follows a dream. But you know, what I think about is that this is all metaphorical for- Matt, wait! I just wanted to say- What did I want to say? What's the moral of this story?! <sighs>
Rewrite the story that it's about an evil rabbit who wants to destroy the bunnies with poisonous carrots and the hero rabbit named Drake saves the day. I guess Drake was uh, in my head all this time. Oh my god, I need help. I wish I could do something that isn't usual. Something that is unusual. You sound stupid. Drake? No, oh, that was last episode. I'm your conscience or some shit like that. So basically, you're imagining me. Mostly due to the fact you're very lonely and don't have that, actually that many friends to talk to in real life. So... Hi. Uh... Anyways, so, uh, what I wanted to tell you was, uh, if you go to channel 69, you'll find, uh, all the things you want. Action, excitement, horror, yes, yes, and wait, what? And that's gonna be your ticket to success. So go to channel 69, do it. Oh, ha, huh. is it the, uh, rerun of the Teletubbies fighting, uh, Cthulhu again? For the third time? You're into that? You're in my mind, how didn't you get that? Man, I need to update my medicine. Fine. I saw a scary creature and I thought it, I, I got, it got away and I don't remember what it looks like. But I think it's going to haunt me forever. He had a mask, and he, um, pulled planks on me. My mother, I told my mother that he touched me in the b If anyone who lives in New Jersey sees a mysterious creature who does weird things, capture it, and and that person will get a $50,000 reward. Although, it had been rumored that those who seek to capture the creature are then haunted by it. Be warned. Man, how does shit like that get aired on television and I'm still not famous yet? Don't you get it? If you find this uh, weird as hell creature, you'll be rich. And I can finally become famous. And you'll be rich. But I'll be famous. <coughs> hey man, I'm gonna go hunt for a mythical creature that I saw from like one infomercial two seconds ago. You wanna join me? Fine, whatever. I can find this creature all on my own. Now all I have to do is find this creature. How do I find him? The infomercial just said that uh, he looks for those who are hunting him, so then he haunts you. So, he'll come to you. Oh wow, that saves me a lot of time having to actually go somewhere haunted. <laughs> Good, right? Yeah, and you know, it's very nice of you to let your uh, family be haunted. Hey, my family be rich. They'll be fine with it. Okay, let's see. I have, uh, what's it? Blah, blah, uh, thing, another thing, uh, object number five. And, of course, my Wii, the old Wii U gamepad. Because if I want to, uh, take down uh, an evil creature, I need a Wii U gamepad. Yeah, whatever, this is disposable. I do have a Switch now. Now! For wait for it to come to me. I need a watch. Wait a minute. I don't even know what the thing looks like. Eh, probably looks like Matthew. Take that. You're not in the room. How did this get on the ground? I didn't put it there. I would know if I put my knife on the ground. It's fine, it's fine. Yeesh, how does this happen? Oh well, it's not like it's gonna happen again. Holy crap! Ugh. Ugh. Oh god, okay. That's, okay, two times that happens. That doesn't mean the third time will happen. I think I'm gonna be good. Oh my god, the knife again! Uh, 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 uh. 
Seriously? This isn't gonna keep scaring me. <sighs> okay, Jake, that was weird as hell. But that's a one time happening. Yeah, it's not gonna happen again. Now it's gonna happen again. But I will be prepared. It's clearly gonna get more weirder than black. Huh. Oh, the same turned on. Oh, you're trying to make me flinch? Yeah, I just may have accidentally hit it. That doesn't mean it's haunted. I've always wanted LED lights, but this is not what I meant. I don't want you to make the house haunted. Now, the whole f***ing room's like a disco. Okay, it was weird, man. I, but if I be persistent, I'll capture the uh, weird creature thing, and uh, I'll be rich and famous. Dude, this is like... <laughs> it's like... It's stupid as hell. Stupider and stupider than... You're in general stupid. This is way more stupid than ever. So, let me get this shit. You don't even know what the f this shit looks like? And you, you're saying this is your shortcut to Hollywood? Or just to fame? The f It's so stupid. Well, one, you could, you know, get me on the news. Or, you know, two, uh, I get the $50,000 reward. Which, um, you know, it will, uh, fund a film school or an indie film. So, there's that. Okay, fine. I'll continue with my quest alone. Quest? And get the thing. I still don't know what it looks like, but I'll get it. <laughs> Show yourself! Wait a minute. Okay, show yourself! I'm behind you. <laughs> Now you're right. Uh, oh, you're three o'clock. That's my three o'clock. Show yourself! I got a Wii U gamepad, I'm not afraid to just dismantle this on your face! Ooh, I love the Wii U. This witch can go f itself. Where are you? Down here. Howdy, I'm playing. You love the jig, right? <laughs> Ark, I'm Blake, I'm Tiny, it's Phantom. How are you scared of me? The size of the bug, I can kill you in two seconds, like, squashing on you. And you're small. I'm a victim, tell you what, you can't kill me. Whatever, just stand still so I can uh, take a picture for my Instagram and I become rich and famous. You know what I mean? You know what? I'll get the things that went out. Bye. What? No, please stay on me. Well, my work is on the road. Thanks for asking. But this is my ticket to become rich and famous finally. You don't know how much this means to me. Well, well, that's bad, man. Did you disappear? I think there would be some smoke ball or something. Oh God. Do you have a point? And is he right? He might be, but that doesn't mean it's shameful. Yes, it is. It is shameful. Because if, that if I need him to become rich and famous, then that means I don't have what it takes as a filmmaker to do it myself. No, it totally isn't. This is my epiphany. I, I don't need him as the ticket to my success. I'm going to make things right. Flint, wait! I wanted to thank you for making me realize what it really means to be a filmmaker and knowing this is not my ticket to success and whatnot. Really? Yeah, I need to focus on my work and, uh... Ah, picture. But, if I need to, I'll use this as blackmail for you to do special effects. Dude, this would be huge! Well, I can do it without you blackmailing me. 
It was a joke. <laughs> I'm working on my comedy. You still here? I can't really tell. Keep working on it, but I'll see you later. Uh, before you go, why didn't I leave this on the stairs? Oh well. Take the Wii U gamepad as a way of saying thank you. I mean, for your forgiveness. I'm not good at apologies. Well, I already have the eight of those. Uh, Danger to the Anchor. Have a good day. Oh. Okay then. Bye! Uh, okay, hey, it's me, your conscience, in physical form of you again. Yeah. Why did you do that? That was stupid! Hey, you'll see what I mean. As you can see, the physical version of my conscience, which is no longer there, and I'm talking to myself out loud, well, I need friends. Uh, as you can see, Blint the Tiny Phantom, written by yours truly. Oh, this will be great. This is going to be a great film. Or a short story. Either way, this is my ticket to success. Because as I learned... Nah, I'm done learning. Let's just get to work. punching myself in the face. Damn it. Why am I so upset again? Hey, it's Jake. Gofried. Yeah, Jake Gofried. Oh, listen. Uh, did you guys... So what do you guys think of the novel? Yes, I am talking to the uh, person from the people, from the people, from the people, from the people, etc. Uh, who get to decide if my novel gets published and put on the bestsellers list and whatnot. Right? That's how it works. Yes, the, a tiny ghost named Flint. Uh, I think that's going to be a real classic. In fact, I wrote that in an hour, believe it or not. I know, impressive, right? And I got to publish it? Okay, then. Ah! Ah! Stupid, 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 stupid. Ow. Why am I going to random places in, my, in the hallway just to scream? Whatever, I'm upset. Ah! Don't. Yeah, that, yeah, that is, that's what it was. <sighs> I guess I could have made this a little neater. I mean, I think it's passable. Maybe I need to put more effort into this. Huh. I guess that voice was actually in my head this time. It's not some, uh, weird doppelganger. <laughs> Looks like things have finally come back to normal. Still, I need to rethink this. I want to be a filmmaker and, a, and writing novels isn't my future, so maybe I need to figure out what makes a cinematic story. You're right, my brain. Okay, what can I use around my room to uh, make a cinematic story? Why is that in my room? Wait a minute, that's it! I can use that to make a cinematic story! Wait, am I a normal person? Wait, why am I looking this up? I know I'm a normal person. I say I'm a normal person, so I know I'm a normal person. That's how it works. And besides, this would be a great chance. If I can uh, capture the ghost on camera, I can use those as special effects since my uh, green screen skills aren't exactly the best. Oh my god! Oh my god! A rhino! Don't hurt me. Hey, Matt. Uh, I know how much you love helping me. No matter uh, what I say it is uh, that I need your help with, no matter how stupid it is or incredibly smart my plans are, you'll help me no question, right? This won't take too long. Well, take your time. Uh... Ugh, good thing I slapped myself away. Do people sleep standing up? I mean, I know sleepwalking is a thing, but nah, anyway, I'm getting away from the plot. Hey, Matthew, so I was wondering if you could help me uh, raise the deck. You see, I was... Fine, I have other brothers. I have Kyle, which is also your brother. 
He's my brother. He's the only other brother I have, including you. I talk like a normal person. Hey, Kyle! Hey, Jake. Get out of the way. I'm trying to do something. Can I finish doing what I was doing? Sure, but I have an offer for you. You want to help me raise the dead? Didn't you already do that? No, he was already a ghost. I just asked him to haunt me. It's a different thing. Wait, aren't you the guy in the commercial? What a coincidence! Hey, can I use your toys to stuff animals or something to perform a seance? Sure. Okay, good. Now I have permission to raise the dead. Now all I gotta do is figure out how to raise the dead. Dang it. Oh, 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 oh. That's not good. Crap. Was this something like this before? Ugh, okay. I don't have an Ouija board. Ouija board. No, I said it right the first time. Good for me. Still, um, okay. What can I have that works as a good substitute? That might work. Okay, ghost. I stand down to you to ask you this question. What house are you haunting, and what's your scarring backstory? Okay, maybe we should be actually playing Trivial Pursuit for me to summon you. Okay, raising the dead might be harder than I thought. <sighs> but not impossible. I just need to figure out how to raise the dead. I mean, I think I... Who's that guy I know? Oh, wait. I can ask Matthew for help. He'll know how to raise the dead. Okay, this is harder than you thought. Just do it. Hey, Matt. Okay, so, you know, you're always my first guy I go to for help. As I said before, I think, and if I didn't, you now know that. <laughs> so anyways, see, I was just thinking, I may need your help for... No way. Fine. I have other friends. Hey, Orson. Uh... Yo, it's Orson. Yeah, I was born in the 21st century. Hey, my parents. Uh, yeah, I kind of know that already. No, I wasn't talking to you. I was just reminding myself of my misery. Uh, anyways, I was wondering if you could summon a ghost for me. Well, my name wouldn't be Orson if I couldn't. I feel like having the name Orson doesn't mean... Alright, I'll summon your ghost. Who is it, anyway? Lincoln? Washington? Skywalker? Uh, no. Whom, then? Anyone, I guess? I don't care. Look, I just need to record the haunting, so... Say no more. Garka farka loopy kark kark. Oh, was that the spell? Great! No, I was having a stroke. Oh. Okay, then. Anyways, I can't reveal to you how I do it. You just gotta wait. Wait? What do you mean, wait? Well, the way the spell works is the ghost will come at night to haunt you, and then we'll leave you in the morning. Why? Well, ghosts are night people, you know? Actually, I mean, this one time recently, I... And I don't care for butts, butts, or asses. Wait, what? Well, anyways, you gotta wait till night, and then what you want to haunt you will come and haunt you. Thanks! No one's ever uh, disturbed uh, the natural order of things before for me. Thank you so much, Orson. No problem. I can be haunted by anything, and I can do it to my own desire. Yeah, that sounds about right. Wait, what did you mean? Thanks, bye! Okay, what am I going to do while I wait? Yeah, I guess I got nothing else better to read. Huh. No wonder the movies suck. It failed to get the source material right. I'm totally ready for a seance. I mean, I gotta tidy up first, but then I'm totally ready to race the dead. Whew! Well, uh, that work's done, I guess. Okay, uh, yeah, this will work. At any time, uh, the stuff animals will come alive and start speaking, and, uh... Oh yeah, the mouse don't move. It... so... it may not, um... 
Okay, so it may not look like they're uh, possessed. Um, hmm. Wow, I have a. Wow, my hand's really big once I make it really close to my. I'm getting distracted. What's my next option? Oh, yeah! They're gonna be haunted, so they're gonna float up. That's gonna be awesome and cinematic. Oh, yeah, it's happening. Wow, this hurts. Okay, showtime. Nah, that's too rude. Showtime, ghouls. You. You. Okay, this can stop. Wow, that really hurt my eyes. Please stop. Stop. Okay, stop. Good. Uh, one, okay, fine. Is Are we done? Okay, this got really scary to kind of annoying. I don't even have a watch. I know this is taking way too long. Okay! Be ghosts, I guess. Oh my stuff. And where are we? Oh, great, we were resurrected. Where are we even? Okay, I know you guys have a lot of questions, but I need you guys to float since your mouse on mood, and I really need the footage. Did I press record on this, or? Who the hell are you? Oh, future Go Golden Globe winner Jake Goffrey of uh, many other awards in the future who uh, asked his friend to uh, resurrect the dead into stuffed animals so... Uh, you can have footage of ghosts uh, for any unknown projects. What? Well, I feel like the... Oh, crap, I ended the recording. I just feel like, uh, you know, the Oscars might be a bit too unrealistic. Which, when you guys ask that question, because I can't really tell you, uh, I, none of your guys' mouths move. Oh my god, we're toys. He doesn't know. Hey, I know things! I know my size! And which is bigger than all three of you guys, because none of you guys have They all make stuffed animals with this bozo doesn't know if he resurrects a ghost into an object. It can't move, but can make the other person move with their minds. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh! I punch really hard! Why are you hitting yourself? It's too cliche for us, you know? Yeah? Oh! Ah, oh! Oh, you these guys fly so I can at least have the footage of that for the- Ow. At least have that for the footage. Is he serious? Yeah, I'm kind of desperate. Oh. 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 <laughs> How about I have you keep punching yourself until we leave in the morning? I'm down for that. Me too. Uh. Oh. Once upon a time, aka somewhere between 1900 and now, I guess, I don't care, two lovers lived or living in Paris, France, the most romantic place in the world because of something, I don't know, or who cares that much anyways, uh, people say Paris is romantic, but I don't see it. Anyways, lover one gives eye to lover two. Lover guy one, uh, what's a romantic name? Uh... Uh, 
Craig Daniels. Craig Daniels, I guess. Looked into the eyes of Jamie. I'll ch no, it's a self. Uh, change the names later. Uh, he looked back at her. I don't know if we should do this. I love you with all my... <coughs> <coughs> oh, ow, man. I love you with all my heart. My parents... My parents, they... They don't approve of... As a, a girl like me is easily attracted to someone like you. A guy as handsome as yourself. And if, uh... Yeah, uh, uh, if I'm your clone... Because we look exactly the same, then there's no one I'd be more attracted to than myself. For obvious reasons. You're a crazy girl. Me? Wait, what? I might have to play both parts because I have no money to pay actors, so... I'm just desperate, okay? So, I guess you both being clones will at least get away with it. Uh, okay? Sh sure? Y you're the guy who's running this? Will you? Make out with me? I would love to make out with one of the most beautiful girls I've ever known. And if you happen to be my clone, which is kind of gross, making out with myself, I wouldn't know how to do it the best since it is myself. Let's do it. Mm -hmm. Are we touching tongues? Mm -hmm. And then they loved. And I mean when they loved. So what you think of the story, Kyle? Oh, what is it? That was terrible. You're a baby. You don't know better. I'm eight. Okay, what's wrong with my story? Tell me. Let me think. You kissing yourself is too gross to imagine. Money is money, you know. And I don't have money, you know. So, you know, I work around not having that. The dialogue is abysmal. I think otherwise. The green screening was bad. I haven't even filmed it yet. I'm describing the story to you right now. How would you even know that? Let me ask you this, Jake. Have you ever been in a relationship? Uh, kind of. I haven't been in a serious relationship, but I've kissed girls before. Like? Well, this one time at a Christmas party, I kissed a girl under a mistletoe, and based on cartoons, I thought it was mandatory to kiss the girl, and, uh... Because I'm Jewish, uh, I didn't know it's not. But hey, being Jewish was a great excuse there. Oh man, you're right. My eight-year-old brother's telling me I'm sad and lonely. I'm eight, bozo. Wait, I didn't say that. I'm a sad and lonely, pathetic person. Good, he's gone. I'm so mature for my age. Now I'm going to play some Minecraft and not do my homework. Oh my god, am I really that lonely? Hey man, wanna hang out? I hate this running joke. What's that? You don't wanna hang out with me either? Well congratulations! You're my 200 caller who said he didn't wanna hang out with me. <laughs> hey Floor, I know you might think I'm cl clingy, but you know what? I like hanging out with you since you don't wanna leave me after being with me just for 5 seconds. Go away! Wait, was my floor literally talking to me as if it were alive in that last flashback? Oh yeah, I almost forgot. I'm the only piece of crap. I think I can live with this. Why am I even leaving my room? It's not like I'm going to say one! God damn it, I can't live like this, I can't- I need real love in my life! I need it! I need it! So I can write the greatest romantic story of all time. And to actually have someone who loves me in life that just isn't my family. And also a better brother who doesn't stick the middle finger in me all the time in my face. Hear that, Matthew? You hear my pathetic monologue? Well, how do I get a relationship anyways? Oh yeah, I live in the 21st century. Internet dating. That's always the best way to do it. Uh. Okay, once uh, I make my demo video for the dating side, surely someone will want to go out with me. I mean, after all, I have such great qualities. I'm nice. No, you dumbass! Get my pizza here now! You're five hours late! How's that even possible? I'm handsome. My only flaw is that I'm too handsome and perfect. I'm clean. <sighs> Yay! 
Yeah, I smell good enough to start the morning. And I'm a great kisser. Wait, why is it just me? Oh, right, I couldn't get an actress to agree to kiss me just for this cutaway joke. Son of a bitch! Female dog! Let's just do this already. I press start or oh, okay, start. Hi, I'm Jake Goffrey. If you ha don't know who I am, what's wrong with you? But if you do know who I am, I'll remind you anyways. I am the best human being ever. The complete package. God wish God peaked when he made me. But here's the thing. Don't you want to be with someone who made God peak? I know. I am a writer, a director, filmmaker, a magnificent artiste. I made the... Uh, I got this into a film festival. This thing is heavy. Let me tell you, could someone else do a better green screen than this? I mean, I'm totally um, staying in this beautiful location. Okay. I'm also Jewish, which is a good bonus because, I, you know, Jews are awesome. I would love to say that if you want, just uh, message me down below, I assume, because I don't know how this website works. Uh, come, uh, come to me and I'll give you a good time. Oh, ow, something in my eye? When does that ever actually happen? And upload it. Now it won't take too long for a girl to actually want to talk to me, and I won't be talking to myself out loud. Wow, I am pathetic. Uh, this is so boring. This is taking forever. Okay, when I say forever, it's not actually been four weeks later. It's only been two days! Oh, God, it's gonna be four weeks if I keep waiting. Ugh. Maybe I actually need to go outside and talk to someone? Nat, I'm just gonna give up. That's what some people in some countries do, I'm not gonna name. Man, I hate having to take this down every time, but wait a minute. All I need to do is uh, practice my talking skills. I mean, I'm not the best talker I know, but I talk good, I say. And besides, I just need to figure out someone to talk to for practice. Who do I know who's willing to listen to me talk like a babbling moron until I can speak like an intelligent British man? Oh wait, no one. Look, I know things didn't go well the first time we met. If anything, uh, you were kind of a jerk. But, uh, I think we can make amends. I mean, you know I'm desperate for lots of things, but um... If we can make amends, uh, I think you could be a great dating coach for me. What do you say? You're a weird person, Jake Gottfried. Ah, oh, ow. Oh, yeah, well. Okay, that was my uh, only option and my last option. What now? Ugh, man, I'm so bad at this. Why can't I have someone just say whatever I want to me? Alexa, what's wrong with me? Here's something I found on the web. According to hubpages.com, there's nothing left. Alexa, how do I improve my dating skills? Sorry, I don't know that one. Alexa, I think you're pretty. That's really nice. Thank you. Man, I'm just practicing my talking skills. It's not weird. Don't you do this sometimes? Alexa, do you know I'm a filmmaker? Alexa, do you know you have eyes from the stars? Alexa, you complete me. Alexa, do you want to date me? I like you, as a friend. You will soon- oh my god, this is messed up in so many ways. I wonder if anyone replied to my profile yet. Okay, let's see. Ah! Someone wants to talk to me. Okay, her name is Candace Sweetbaum. She has a twin sister named Isa, a dog named Ivan. She's into filmmaking. She is a huge supporter for Rights for Turkeys and is willing to date anyone. Okay, that's good enough for me. Let's see if she wants to chat. <laughs> I should probably not be wearing the suit. Hi, Jake. Uh, hi, Candace. Wow, you're, um, very pretty. Thanks. Tell me everything you want to tell me. You sure? 
<laughs> Why not? So, what about you? Uh, I like filmmaking and food. You're such a nice guy to talk to, Jake. Really? Yeah, you listen to me way more than my dogs do. Um, okay. So, are you busy? I'm busy all the time, but you were able to waste eight hours listening to me. Uh, thanks. Wanna talk again tomorrow? Sure! It's a shame you live in California and I live in New Jersey. And it's, you know, too far for us to meet in real life at the moment, but maybe someday. Maybe someday. Well, bye. Haha, <laughs> bye. Wow, Candace is so nice and beautiful. But man, is she exhausting. I just met her today and she just talks so much. Like, you know what? I'm a good boyfriend for letting her speak. Uh, I should always listen to women, but man, it's annoying. Uh, not that uh, you girl, not that I actually think of women or girls like that in real life at all. Um, I'm very res respectful and nice. So, if any girl wants to date me in real life, just let me know. Oh, well, excellent. You get me, right? Thank you. I do try. I mean, I really like being with Candace, but it's so much to ask for. Alexa, you think I should be with her? Sorry, I'm not sure. Alexa, do you think I should be with you? Hmm, I don't know that one. You know what? You know what? I am not doing this storyline. It's weird and creepy right off the bat, and I don't need an episode to know that dang technology is wrong. Man, it's wrong at so many levels. I have a beautiful girl that's nice and listens to me a lot and really is into things I like. I shouldn't be so naive to that. Alexa, even though you're just a machine and you are just a machine and that's all you really are, thanks for helping me to know now that I should totally be with Candace. Jake, you're a great guy now, but I realized something. Uh, what's that? I can't be with you anymore. We dated for just w one day. What went wrong in just a day? I think we should just be friends. Uh, that doesn't answer my question. Thanks for understanding. Bye, Jake. Wait, I... And she ended the FaceTime. <sighs> you know, despite the, my relationship with Candace not going well, I think I learned from uh, her what it's like in a relationship for my stories. And I think I grew as a person. I should be proud of that. What do you think, Alexa? Okay, you're not going to say anything? At least using Alexa for therapy is less weird than having her as a girlfriend. You know what I'm saying? The person I'm not talking to out loud to myself? Uh, oh. I'm still weird, and I'm still sad and lonely at the end of this episode. I didn't grow as a person, I only became more pathetic. MOTHER! <laughs> Ow. Get hold of yourself, Jake. You may be sad, you may sound incredibly weird when you cry, but you are a 16-year-old dude with a beard. A really big, thick beard. You're too tough to cry. Whenever it's been obvious, I've been sad. Okay, I guess that's one example. <laughs> Just one. <sighs> I'm so sad. I'm eating. What am I eating? Oh, gross! These things are terrible! Did we get a new couch? When did we even get a new couch? I sing this song because I'm sad! Fine voice of Gilbert Gottfried and a dying sparrow. Yeah, well, I'm sad! So take that! I'm sad, world. I'm sad. Be quiet. 
jump! Uh, I'm sad. Uh, I'm sad. Go away. Go away. Hey, show magical talking floorboard. No one asked you. You're just wood. I put my feet on. I have a life. Literally. You're just wood. I'm throwing comeback. I'm throwing lame comebacks to my floor. <sighs> I'm a haunted stuffed animal, and my life is less demeaning than yours. Wow, when you put it like that, I guess my life is, uh, kind of pathetic. Hey, weren't you supposed to go back to hell, by the way, at this point? I thought you uh, only could be here for like a day or something. Apparently, Satan thought it'd be a better punishment to leave us like this. And I will say, talking to you is torture. Wow, my life is so weird. I wish things would just be... Normal. That's all I've been wanting. Well, that and money and fame. I mean, it's not too much to ask for. But still, I just wish things could go back to normal. You know what? At least I know one person I might be able to talk to. I just hope he wants to talk to me. Okay, good. I hope he picks up. You know, if there's anyone I know who summoned three ghosts for me into stuff ammos, they are now haunting me forever. You know what? I'm done rambling gibberish. I think I filled my quota up for a Tuesday. What the hell? Oh, Satan must have changed his mind and want us to come back. I knew the devil liked this. Our juice. What the? Wait, weren't you... end up in jail, one of us will have to do a guy to survive, I bet it's gonna be you! Okay, Jake, if the ghost made you insane... No, I'm perfectly semi-normal! Alright, good to hear. So what's up? Either A, a girl broke your heart, or B, a mysterious entity from another world wants to kill you again. Uh... Uh, A? Weird, I'm so sure the answer is B. So, what happened? Wow, that's a lot of exposition I answer here. I'll just go with it. Uh, Jake? Oh, I guess you can't- alright, you can't hear my sarcastic thumbs up. So, what's next? Well, I'm gonna go outside, stand in the rain if rain comes, and uh, and uh, put my bare feet in a puddle of disgustingness. I have questions? Yes, 12, Abraham Lincoln. <sighs> Am I supposed to laugh at that? I was hoping you laughed, it would mask my insecurities. Um, would you just admit it to me? Tell me how I'll be happy! I just need to know how to be happy! Weren't you working on some special project, a short film for school? Uh, yeah, many months ago, why? Just finish making that and remind yourself what makes you happy. Thanks, Orson, you're a really cool dude. You too, you're, but not really, you're kind of messed up in three show and in one ways. Man, I love you too. Well, bye. Man, I hope I don't see him soon. Oh God, it's Tuesday, not Thursday. Why would that make, why would that make any difference? Jake? I thought I hung up on you. Man, if there's anything I know from editing, it could take weeks just to edit a 10 minute short. Man, I am so tired. Oh man, I need some sleep. No, I need to continue working on my- HOLY CRAP KNIFE! A random knife appears in front of me out of thin air. Where have I seen that before? Ow. Man, this is itchy. Wait a minute. I know. The flint. The gray minuscule 
Wii U loving, cowboy, cowboy hat wearing, judge robe wearing ghost. Wait a second. Still, I wonder what Flint's up to now. Boy, I love good drugs. Better than real drugs. He's like, <laughs> it can't kill you. But I'm already dead. I think you might have a problem. Well, once I get this done, I'll... Crap, what am I going to do? Am I going to put this on YouTube when it's done? Am I going to get praised or ridiculed? Is the knife on my desk gone? Well, I'll raise no concern. To editing! Ugh, man, this is fun! Fun! You know what? I forgot why I was sad in the first place. Uh, you forgot your girlfriend that was with you for just one day broke up with you because she was with you for just one day. Huh. I hope when this doesn't all end, uh, it turns out there's a huge twist where I was in a Santa asylum this whole time. Hey, Matt! Hey Jake, how's the like, short film thing you're doing going? Pretty good, almost done. You know, at school, I actually had uh, friends who wanted to uh, be in my films willingly, help me write, uh, you know. And you know, this summer I didn't have it. In fact, this summer has been, you know, pretty poopy. <laughs> did, did, did you just say poopy? Yes, I said poopy. Pretty poopy, you know. Why? You could have used so many other adjectives, but poopy? Don't do not criticize me about my adjectives, okay? I don't. I'm, I'm not in the mood to be funny awkward. I'm just in the mood to be awkward awkward. Just, just awkward then, you mean? See, you get it. Look, Jake. You gotta start looking at stuff that is real. Like this. You like doing that, don't you? You know me too well, man. You know, Matt. Despite some bad things that happened to me, like a lot of bad things, at least I have you. What's the thing of it, man? Like, I've been treating, I've been a real jerk towards you as of late. Oh, like. Well, I mean, you know, I mean, true, but. It, wait, no, actually, yeah, you know, you, you have been a jerk to me. Get, get out of my life. Alright, man, if you want me to so badly, I'll get out of here. Yeah, leave. <sighs> Yeah, I really hope like Jake back for Shadow. He doesn't come back and kick me in the ass. Irony! The iron trick! of the video, I deleted it all together, so uh, please stop, wherever you are. I'm dead. It's all so about the truth of me. I didn't need answers. Why wasn't this explained before? Flint! Uh, Flint! The other ghosts in my life, I don't know their names. Oh, why are my parents ever around for weird stuff like this? I don't know. They killed mine. Oh my god, Drake? What? How? I mean, I mean, I, okay, I guess it was kind of obvious, I mean, you know, <clears throat> sorry, my voice has been kind of cracking, I guess I've been jumping dimensions too much, but whatever, my throat might hurt, but my, I'm gonna kill you anyways. Hey, why are you being scared of you? You're just in my mind. Oh my god, I'm a lunatic. Uh, I'm holding this knife, you know? Are you gonna kill me with that? Well, yes, I mean... Oh, I mean, well, not at the moment, I mean, with this knife, yes, I will kill you with this knife, just, you know, not right now, but... Trust me, this is gonna have your blood all over it. Wait, oh, I don't think you get it. I'm real. What? Okay, this is incredibly confusing. Don't worry, there's a good answer to all of this. Which is... I have a long story. I mean, I had to change my plan a lot, considering, uh, you know, now I, ha I have to kidnap Matthew now. 
Yeah, well, you gotta crack a few eggs. <coughs> what does that have to do with this? I don't know, crack eggs, kill your brother. I was supposed to kidnap Candace, but apparently in this dimension she's not your girlfriend. So, I have to make do with what I got. Uh, uh what? Hold still as I jump you. Not without a fight! Oh crap! Oh. Such a handsome devil, is it, aren't you? Ah! Where am I? <laughs> Hello! Great, explain now! No, we gotta wait. Wait? Wait for what? Oh, for the finale. The finale? What does that even mean? Yeah, you know what that means. Yeah, I know what that means. I just, I, I like to end this part on a joke, you know? I don't, I don't want people to take this, like, way too seriously, okay? Oh, you got anything funny to say then? No? Yeah, what well, perfect f*** you to end the day with. Okay, answers should be given. You know, otherwise there, um, wouldn't be questions. Was that supposed to sound wise and clever? Well, I mean, okay, well, you know, I think I should probably start asking you, why the hell, also, how the hell are you here? I guess you want answers. Yeah, that's what I said. Do you want the answers, doggy? What? We're all over! We're all over! Why would I roll over like a dog? Uh, are you scared? Yes, I'm scared. I've been kidnapped, tied up. I, I don't know where I am. What do you think I'm going to do? Ask you out on a picnic? Well, if this was Beauty and the Beast. Don't make this a Stockholm Syndrome joke. Fine! You want to know what you want to know? Why are you talking like this? It's usually funner when you don't have the hero be a wise ass. Okay, here's my story. I come from a different world, where it turned out I was real after I tricked you into ruining your legacy with the lame video and killed you afterwards. Unfortunately, even, uh, although I, I thought I got away, unfortunately, I got caught. Stand there and smile. I was going to be fish slapped. I was going to be fish slapped to death. Uh, is fish slapped to death a thing in this universe? Because I feel like it's a bit too weird to be a thing in general. I always thought that, but is it like here, or is it like... Oh, uh, what happened next? Oh yeah, so... I es I es I... <clears throat> uh, sorry, need to clear my throat. I escaped from prison and found a lab to open the portal to a new dimension, which thankfully had bad security, and also apparently multiverse traveling machines are a rarity in the multiverse. Uh... I... Shut up, I'm talking. And I found infinite worlds where infinite possibilities were, were there, and including one where I ruled the world. But that was too easy. Take over myself and take myself's place? What? I said shut up! Anyways, I found your dimension and decided during the <sighs> night you brought three ghosts back from the dead and get my revenge on you. <laughs> Out my throat! What revenge even? You didn't like my sandwiches! So, hmm, let's see. So my twin from another universe that didn't like your sandwiches is enough for you to kill me and then jump the mansions into a, re a reality where you don't even exist as a second hand of revenge? Okay, I guess when you put it like that, it does sound a bit nuts. What are you even going to do with Matthew? Don't worry, he's in my hotel room. I mean, <clears throat> torture chamber, where I'll kill him. Don't worry, I won't kill you. Yet. You're not? No, I will decapitate your brother and then bring his head back for you to see. I'm a caring person, aren't I? I can't even begin to comprehend the other crap you said before. I mean, your backstory is so stupid and complex and... No, it's just stupid. Why not just kill me now in case I stop you? Uh, hmm, let me think. You're you? Wow, I'm insulted easily.
Yep, I'm leaving you alive, and this won't come back to bite me, where I go, I should have killed you when I had the chance. Specific cliche. Right, and I'll be right back, bringing you your brother's decapitated head with his eye. In fact, I'll pluck his eyeballs right out. <laughs> oh my god, what's wrong with you? Uh, didn't you hear my incredible backstory? I'm nuts. Well, I guess it makes enough sense. Wait a minute, no it doesn't. Well, I'm gonna do something crazy. Bye bye Well, I guess it's up to me to save the day. Huh, it's up to me to save the day. Wow, that'd be so cool. This actually wasn't really, um, kind of scary, you know, that my, uh, brother's gonna die. And also other people, since he's a psychopath. Yeah, I really need to get out of here. Uh, ow, wow, it's cramped. All I gotta do is escape from this rope. How hard can that be? Well, that took 37 minutes, but, uh, I still say it's impressive enough that I just did it with my bare hands. Now, to unlock the door. Ow, ow, it's cramped, it's cramped, it's cramped. Now, to figure out how to unlock the door. The door. Wow, he didn't actually lock the door. I'm someone that's salted. He didn't think that high of me that I could actually escape. Wait a minute. I, I know what this place is. Hi. Uh, Orson? Yep. What the? This is your house? Well, my basement slash bedroom slash back cave. Uh, my evil twin from another dimension kidnapped me and held me hostage in your closet. You didn't do anything about it? Expect me to? Well, I, I guess not. I mean, you're Orson. Point made. But still, why? Long exposition or short exposition? Uh, short? I knew this book was right. Anyways, Drake chloroformed me, knocked me out, monologue, evil location, used my home because he didn't have a basement. He's pretty dumb. Thank God he is, or otherwise, you know, it'd take a crap ton of time just to figure out where he is, by the way. Where is he, by the way? You're not gonna like it. He's at a hotel. What am I supposed to be scared of? It was once a nuclear factory. Really? Yep, that's about it. Uh, you okay? Not really. I've been traumatized. Well, if you're traumatized, I guess I'm gonna need someone else's help. But whom? Whom? You like saying the word whom a lot, don't you? Yes, yes I do. Get out of my house, by the way. I need to think over literally everything. Okay, I'm back from being kidnapped. Wow. I gotta save my brother! Oh, God. What am I gonna do? I need to make a plan. I need backup support. I, I need, um, I, I need, I need... I gotta plan this out. And to do that, I'm gonna need some backup support. I just said that already. Man, I'm scared and nervous. I gotta save Matthew. What am I doing again? What's 2 plus 2? Oh, yeah. Okay, I know Drake kind of killed you guys again. I don't know. I really, I have really no clue how this works, but come on. You know, come on, come on. Still be alive. Still be alive, you know. Come on. I know you're haunted to stuff animals. Wow, this is, I never really thought, you know, I say this kind of stuff because, you know, it's uh, really stupid, but, you know, um, be alive, be alive. Oh, I never thought I'd say this, but I really wish my stuff animals were still alive and haunted. It's a shame I don't know any more ghosts. Wow, I really never thought I'd say this. Oh, man, I wish Flint was here. I am here. Ah! You had to surprise me. Yeah, it's, it's butt screwing, but it's, it's a good one. I regret so much with so little to regret with. Uh, anyways, uh, what do you want me to do? Great, here's the plan. I want you to... <coughs> good cocaine. It's good. Better than real cocaine, I'll tell you that. I so hope this works, because Matt's life literally depends on this, and also my life, and countless others. Wow, the fate of the world is on me. What a responsibility that really shouldn't be mine is bestowed on me. Anyways, here's the plan. 
Okay. I can do this. I can do this. <sighs> That's his apartment right there. Be strong, be confident. Okay, you can do this. Save the day, rescue the damsel. Well, Matthew, in distress. <sighs> what could go wrong? Okay, let's, I should probably think of something better and cooler to say. Actually, I should have brought a weapon with me. I mean, he is a psychotic killer who, from another dimension uh, you don't know anything about. Actually, I could have called the cops. I did not think this out well. Oh, no. <laughs> I knew you'd be coming. Uh, you think you're going to save the day? <clears throat> you think you're gonna save the day? My voice hurts. Yes! I haven't killed Matt yet, but pfft, screw it. One item off the bucket list at a time. I am now confused. Good. It makes it easier for the idiot to fall. Oh. Take that! Ugh. What's taking Flint so long? Oh yeah, he's tiny. Is is this Flint so tiny? He has such a tiny Really? <clears throat> Who is he by the way? Who is he by the way? Uh he's a cop and he's got the ammo. Does he have the Would you stop with those jokes? People don't like those jokes. <clears throat> What the heck? wants to get back together. It's almost like the universe saying sorry that we let someone from a different dimension almost kill you. Thank you universe for, you know, rewarding me for not dying to that. Yeah, things can go back to normal now. So, yeah, um, so yeah, me and Candace are back together. I think no one, I mean nobody saw that coming. Man, like, that's just weird, but alright. Uh, cool. I mean, I guess okay, but so what's the deal with Drake? Oh, um, I don't know. I mean, I had a weird enough summer with him. I know he left you traumatized. Yeah, we, we can't talk about that. Yeah, but hey, you know, um, I'll deal with him next season. The cops can handle him for now. Yeah, hopefully next season won't involve me too much. Oh, Matthew, we'll have to wait and see if there's even a season two at all. 
How about the, uh, the scorpion? Did you get that done? Uh, are you gonna show me it? Or are you even gonna show me it? Um, see, that's the thing, Matt. I'm gonna show you it right now. That's where we're both on this couch. And, um, the thing is, I'm a bit nervous about showing you it, but, you know what? I put it up on YouTube. Anyone can see it now. I don't know if it's gonna go viral or not, but I just hope people like it. Let's see if people will like it. You know, Matt? Whatever happens, if one likes one thing and another doesn't, or vice versa, or if one succeeds, the other shouldn't give up. I'm not a wise man, but I am still learning to keep on to my dreams and move forward. That that was that was unbelievable, Sappy. Like, I just I have to. I just I just I have to. I have to. Yeah, let's just watch the damn movie. <laughs> Where's the rug? Oh, there it is. Yep. Oh, come on! No! No! I we're, no, we're, we're going, going like this! I thought we were going this way. I said no! I mean, kinda! Well, I mean, okay, so it's like. It's gotta be like this! Put your arms like bam! No! <laughs> you're out! My, my elbow! Man, no! Not my, your you, elbow! Just you're your ruining fist. the moment! You're ruining this! It's my show! I, I forget. Let's just watch. Yeah, but just play it!